Hey, welcome back everyone to another Let's Play for God of War. So we are going to uh, flip the temple, as uh, Mimir put it so eloquently in the last part. And um, this should be very exciting. We had pretty badass fights in the last part as well. Lots of enemies, things like that. And here it is, like this thing is like already in sync. So let's just cruise on through. Oh, he's coming through there. Okay, Atreus, take your time. Do your thing. What are these noises? Okay. I don't think it's... No, this is, this is not it. This is not it. This is the other... This is the other... Um, what you call it? Um, mystery. Yeah, we've already done this. Yep, we already did that part. Time to go up. So, just to see, as I like to recap at times, uh, any updates here? No, okay, go back up and flip the temple, see? That's what we're gonna do. Flip it. Brothers, I know what I promised, but in case this doesn't work, just remember, Tyr had good cause to create these obstacles. He's kept Jotunheim out of Odin's reach, but the world is hardly at peace. No, but it's got hope. We're all working together now. We have unity. That's what the rune on the door to this place was telling us. We're on Tyr's path. That's a good attitude. That's a really good attitude, um, Atreus. Working together, unity, those are good words. And uh, are these two giants gonna come and attack us, man, as soon as we flip the temple, or what? Okay, let's do this, I'm super excited. Are you excited? You gotta leave me a comment down below. Just say something like, I was excited, exclamation, ah, exclamation, 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 or something, you know, because I am excited. Kind of like the Seinfeld episode where, you know, Elaine's, like, big on exclamations. And then later on, Newman and Kramer are, like, writing something, you know, and the whole episode's all about exclamations, and they're like, double exclamation! You know, after this statement, one exclamation! You know. <laughs> Alrighty. So I kind of feel very uh, much like double or quadruple exclamations right now. Alright. Excited with quadruple excla exclamations, I mean. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Lift with your legs, brother. He knows. Just <laughs> trying to be helpful. <laughs> I'm a meter man. <laughs> okay, I'm smashing my button. Is the answer? I'll be quite happy to be on your side, brother. And we're not dead. That's a plus. There, on the left. I think we can climb back up to the realm travel room from there. Oof. Okay. So let's see. We can climb. Oh, okay. Here it is. I was like, anything else that popped out of this? Besides the climb part? Nope. Alrighty. Let's do this. See that, Mimir? Nobody can do all this alone. All these obstacles. They're just chances to prove we're the ones who can beat them. We may argue. Me and Father. You and Freya. Brock and Sindri. But when we all work together, we do make a good team. And that's Tyr's test. That's why we're gonna make it to Odenheim. Do you hear that, brother? Lads found his equilibrium. What's that mean? He <laughs> means you speak wisely, Atreus. And that is good to hear. Yes. Okay, I, I wanted to hear that. I don't like to, like, climb and stuff and... You know, then miss out on something. Okay. Although, before we head back up, I do feel 
that I think this might be Odin's sort of twisted strategy also to make or use Kratos and Atreus and Freya and Mimir and Brock and Sindri to open the door to Jotunheim which has been hidden because Odin was not intelligent enough maybe meaning he is intelligent but not intelligent enough to do that so he used Kratos the god of war um, to do that but that remains to be seen so speculation on my part maybe but we'll see okay let's see where are we going Come on, I don't see any indications. Oh, I see. We climb. Wow. Temple flipped upside down. Hey, come look at this. Is he telling me to drop down? No, that's where we came from. Wh what did you want me to look at, Atreus? Is there something through the leaves? It's like the Predator moment, you know, from the 1987 or whenever it was made, the Arnold Schwarzenegger flake, like, over there, past them trees. When Billy's like looking over there, he's like, there's something in those trees, Sergeant. Love the first part of her. Okay, can I climb? What am I doing here? What were you saying again, Tris? Maybe you were onto something. Where did we climb up from? Did we climb up from here? And now we're gonna go down here? No, this is where we came. What? Oh, okay, I see. Duh, and right in front of me. Collect Tears Mysterious Object. Wow. This is like so dark, man. Huh. Ha! Huh. I guess the temple was made to be flipped. Look, the tree's upside down. Or are we? I'm not sure anymore. Oh no shit. This is the bottom of the tree. So the secret Tears mysterious secret was hidden below it. Weird. Why is a trace over there? If he's over there, there's something over there. Is there? I just wanna explore this place a bit. Before I go interact or whatever. So make sure there are no like treasure chests or something that I'm missing. I don't think so. Okay, let's go. Do we got a major boss fight? Like literally right out at this point. Roy, your knife. Good point. A rune stone? Well, what have we got? Some sort of travel stone. Let me see. Great are Dumblazadas. That's the Unity Stone. You know it. I wasn't sure it existed. If Tyr possessed this, that explains how he could visit all the realms and other lands to boot. He held this in the panel in Odin's library. Yes. Yes, that's it. I understand now. It shows Tyr walking the realm between realms. You know how you must never stray from the path. Well, Tyr always followed his own path, if you catch my meaning. 
the realm between realms. Explore the realm between you're realms. You're saying Tyr's shrine showed him stepping off the branch of the world tree. And you're thinking to reach the secret path to Yodenheim, that's what we need to do? I am. Oh dear. That is what you're thinking, isn't it? Okay, let's read what we just what happened. What lies off the path of the world tree? We flipped the temple and found the unity stone, which Mimir says should let us go off the path when we are walking on the world tree in the realm between realms. This is getting crazy, but if it gets us to Jotunheim, we've come too far to quit now. I agree. So we are walking on the let she'll let us go off the path when we are walking on the world tree in the realm between realms. So when we rotate on the realm tree, as we go from realm to realm, somewhere in between the realms, that's where the hidden tower or path is? Okay. Let's do this man, super excited. Let's do this. Okay, should we do we have enough now to up? You're talking. By the way, I realized that the Talon Bow is not gonna show up anymore because uh, we have already upgraded it to its max capacity, which is why it has not been showing up. Nothing to here, nothing to here. Oh what do you know? I can upgrade this button? All the others aren't really giving me much, but I can upgrade this. Enchantment sockets, one to two. Do I have anything in the enchantment sockets here? Up this guy, buy better. Okay, let's just do this. I think we have enough hack silver and solid swartle fine steel, okay. And we're getting more on strength, a little bit, a little bit, not too much, but a little bit. And we're getting an enchantment socket, okay. I'm sure your winning smiles aren't are enough, but why take chances? I agree. Okay, thank you very much. That should do it for now. Well, see you next time you need something. I'll see you when I see you. Okay. Let's see. This one, right? Yep. Ooh, we got some interesting ones. Cooldown. Look at that. Ah, plus six on the runic and cooldown. Isn't that nice? What else we got? Definitely doing this one. That gives me cooldown and... What else? Anything better? We can sort it by runic here. Let's just do it by runic. Four on the runic, two and vit oh, vitality. Ooh, four. Nah, I think that, I think I, I kind of got the best one, the bunch. Okay. So I'm sorting on the bottom. If you see, I says sort by rarity, sort by strength, sort by runic. That's what I was doing. Okay, I think this is as good as it's gonna get for this one. Six, yep. High perk activation chance to grant a blessing of runic on any successful parry. Hmm, not bad. Okay. And what about my other ones? Do I have two sockets on the Rune Weaver War Belt? I do not. Um, should I? Waste armor. Let's just do that real quick before we head over. Sure, I'm open. Waste armor. Let's see. Wrist waste armor. I already got the better one. Okay, let's upgrade this enchantment socket. Yep. Hack silver, Aegir's gold, and solid swat fine steel. 
Every chance I'm gonna get to say Swartalfime, I'm gonna say it. Swartalfime. Swartalfime. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Alright, now we go and... See you next, where's I see you? Okay. Alright. Did it not give me? Are you freaking kidding me? Did it not? Did it just upgrade the stats? Oh shit. Let me see, let me see, let me see. Now you're talking! Sorry, I know I'm going back and forth here, but... What's going on? Which one do I have equipped here? How come it's not showing me the equipped one? Oh, I'm sorry, armor. I'm like in upgrades of craft upgrade of okay. yeah boy massively reduces the talent's bows recharge time what'd you forget Wait, I have to craft that. I can't upgrade it anymore. Time for another break. I might be getting confused. Hang on a second. Sorry. Let me just check something here. This one... Racers of the World Serpent is the wrist armor. It is equipped. And this one is Rune, Rune Weaver War Belt. Waste armor, and if I go and talk to him with Let's the waste get you armor, squared away then. Waste armor. Rune Weaver War Belt. I guess I can't. I upgraded something. I know. Gosh, I'll have to watch my video. Okay, so I guess if I can't, if I can no longer upgrade it. It's done, right? Wait, this one... This one says I can, but I'm not... I don't have that equipped. There. Okay, Next I'm good. Time, I guess. As I've told you before, I like to... S I don't like to cut through or like edit those sections out where I'm in the menu and thinking through because I want you to sort of see my thought process. So I hope you appreciate it. Alright, let's go to this. The realm between realms. What do you know? It's like a hidden mystery something. If you're thinking about hurling us all into the void, I hope you're quite sure. Wasn't it your idea? Find our own path, right? Bollocks. Take the Unity Stone to the preci precipice. Okay. Oh wow, dude. This is getting heavy. Do you guys see a ship down there? Do you see that? I see something down there. Can I see stuff before I jump? Oh man, oh man. This is so amazing. This whole place that we used to jump before in the beginning of the game and we were dying. Here we go. Let's do this. This is where Tyr stepped beyond and the Unity Stone protected him. Ready? Ready. Well, if this is it, lads. It's been an honor. Our faith head. This is incredible! Can I be so nauseous without a stomach? 
Come on. That was great. Look. The tower. I knew there was something down here. Amazing. How do you hide something that exists in all realms? Cast it out of any realm to the space between. Clever old tear. Is Jotunheim on the other side? Can't be that. It's not like you go through Vanaheim to reach the Midgard Peak. But how do we use it? I'd suggest we look inside, but stay alert. Tyr's little challenges are never as simple as they appear. I have noticed. <laughs> well said, Kratos. Well said. I have noticed. Jotunheim Tower. Whoa. Okay, before we go there. So, somehow Tyr and the Giants hit the Jotunheim Travel Tower in the Realm Between Realms. The Unity Stone got us here, but can it get the tower... Can it get the tower home? And can we survive the ride? Can we get the tower home? Can we survive the ride? Let's investigate the Jotunheim Tower. Okay, we will. Just trying to see if there's anything nearby. This is one amazing tower, isn't it? Wow, okay. What do we got? They're giving us health and rage. Whoa. Well, this is sparse. The pedestal. Use the Unity Stone. We got enemies coming. Oh, yeah. We got enemies coming. They're giving us rage and health. Alright, hold on. Somehow, Tyr and the Giants. Okay, it's the same. Okay, use the Unity Stone. This room is a pretty kick-ass room, if, you, if I don't mind saying. Alright, let's do this. Oh no! You took the stone! The tower! It's absorbing the stone's energy! Something's happening! Is it moving? It's moving! It knows what to do! The stone served its purpose. We're fulfilling Tyr's spell. What happens now? No idea, brother. But after that fall, I'm sure we're past the worst of it. it smells like Nifo. Uh-huh. Oh, no, this is considerably worse. Yep. Is it? Brood. Okay. These things are a complete mystery. They always show up in the in groups, but at least they go down fairly easy. They don't have weapons, but they can grow their limbs into sharp points that are just as dangerous. They also tend to try and latch onto father and use their greater numbers to overwhelm us. They can poison us, and we need to be extra careful of their leaping attack. The brood explode when they die. We can use this to damage and knock away any nearby enemies. Good to know. Ah, More. Oh, looks like Alphon. Watch He
nightmare father can hit them twice these nightmares can blind us for a little bit just when I thought okay father can hit them twice on the same axe throw once on the throw and once on the recall these would make good target practice for me and my bow a couple of arrows would probably bring them down that's what I was doing okay hang on a second so um, let me see is there any no. oh no we're back in hell Oh dear, here they come. Okay, hold on. If we can freeze or weaken it, it won't be able to recover in the air when launched or knock out. It's so strong and has thick armor but leaves itself open after certain attacks. If we can freeze or weaken it, which is what I'm doing with Kratos' attacks, it won't be able to recover in the air when launched or knocked out of aerial attacks. Okay. Let's see what more we got. Keeping track on time, I don't want to make the part too big. I think we can handle it. Oh, jeez. I was trying to go for the R3 on the Ogre. It didn't work.
that. You stop. We killed this one while trying to restore the Dowdy Manor. Uh, we killed this one while trying to restore the Jotunheim Tower to the lake. Restore the Jotunheim Tower to the Lake of Nine in all the realms. When the doors opened to Muspelheim, I guess he wanted to see what was happening. Why is every troll's first and only instinct to attack? No shit. I think it's over. Aye, but where are we? Wrath of the Ar Artemis, light runic attack, a slash attack that protects Kratos by pushing away all nearby enemies. What is this? Oh, a better light runic attack? Uh, which one do I have? Cyclone of Chaos. I don't know about better. I like the Cyclone of Chaos because it's... But this one seems interesting. Pressing... Okay, so a slash attack that protects creators by pushing away all nearby enemies. Performing R1 again after the first slash from the second crisscross attack that launches enemies into the air. Now we can try it. Okay. I don't want to make the part too long, but let's see. Let's pick stuff up. Let's get rage. Okay. So where we are in the story now is still the same survive the gauntlet of realms which i think we did I'm not sure if there's like a bug that i am not able to get an exit or what i don't see any interaction points or is this a puzzle to get out might be a puzzle tier stuff is riddled all the way I hope this is not like a... This is not it. Oh, it's the main door here. Ma, duh, my bad. Yep. Okay. So, we will... We survived a bunch of fights. Hope that was fun for you as it was fun for me fighting these enemies. And I will catch you in the next one.